Just follow me through. Who? Who? Follow me through. Follow me through who? Oz got a Bible story for me and you. Oh, hi, friends. I'm Justin the Mailman. It looks like it might be raining soon. Can you guys put up your pretend umbrellas so we don't get wet? Ready? Good. Now raise your hand if you like rainstorms. Mm -hmm. Now raise your hand if you sometimes find them to be a bit scary. It's okay. Rainstorms can be loud sometimes. In fact, I have a story for you about a storm. Do you want to hear it? Let me just... Okay, so this true story from the Bible is about a time that Jesus and his friends, the disciples, were out on a boat. When suddenly, it began to rain. Everyone try this. Good. And then the wind began to blow. Everyone blow. And it rained harder and harder. And the wind was blowing. And then there was lightning and a clap of thunder. Ready to clap? One, two, three, clap. And the boat was blowing this way. And the boat was blowing that way. And the waves were crashing. Crash, crash, crash. The disciples were so afraid. Everyone make your afraid face. They didn't know what to do. Who can you go to when you're afraid? That's right, Jesus. They didn't know what he could do, but they knew they could go to him. But when they went to him, he was asleep. Let's see if we can get Jesus to wake up. Say it with me. Jesus, wake up. Jesus, wake up. Jesus, wake up. Jesus, the disciples said, save us from the storm. We're so afraid. And Jesus said, don't be afraid. And he told the wind and the waves to stop. And guess what happened? The wind and waves stopped because Jesus, God's son, told them to. You guys, there is nothing too big for Jesus. He can calm a storm. He can do anything so we don't have to be afraid. The disciples needed Jesus, and we need Jesus too. Oh, hey there, Ollie. Tell me, who do you need? I need Jesus. Yes, it's true. Now let's hear it from you. Tell me, who do you need? I need Jesus. That's the truth, friends. You better believe it. Bye.